Hey guys, Eamon here, back with another tipping video. We got the round 13 tips, and we'll go over the standings in round two, and I guess overall in our in our little league. Um, yeah, if you're not in the in the leagues, make sure to join them. There's links in the description. We got one on Super Brew and one on the NRL site. Uh, I'm gonna stick to the Super Brew one for the video, and then I'll, I'll just input my picks on the NRL site after, because uh, I noticed the NRL site actually shows like um, before you make your picks, it shows like how many people chose each team. So I kind of want to avoid looking at that, so I'm not like swayed by. Uh, outside opinions i guess um yeah we'll see um yeah so yeah this, this is gonna be an interesting week uh with with the origin teams um i'm gonna try to do my best to remember who got uh selected to the teams because I, I, I just did a video on that it should be uploaded by the time this is up um or actually no maybe i'll upload that one after yeah i'm gonna upload that one after this one actually because this one's probably better to get out sooner yeah anyways any other than that um yeah so i'll try to make my picks uh using some of that info obviously lots of teams a few teams like roosters and the Brewsters broncos and like eagles panthers i think have the most guys on the teams so they'll be obviously hit the hardest i guess um i mean depends on their depth i guess some teams just have unlimited depth it seems so yeah um yeah before we hop in though make sure make sure to drop a sub drop a like comment and yeah obviously join uh join the join the tipping leagues we got i think we got like 30 to 40 people in each league so uh that's pretty awesome um and yeah i still haven't really decided on what, what we can do for a prize I, I was thinking maybe like each every four rounds i'll just take the winner from each uh from each week and then do like a little i'll just do like a draw and then the, t the person that wins the draw gets to pick the video i react to or something something like that i don't know that might be that's all I can really think of. Well, yeah, something like that might be fun. Um, anyways, yeah, let's hop into it. Yeah, so let's take a look at the uh, let's take a look at the standings from last week. Um, how do I sort this for just round? Is this just round twelve? Yeah, just round twelve. Okay, let's see how I did. I don't think I did well at all. I'm pretty sure I might have got like one of the worst. Where's my? Where is? Where am I? Oh no! What the hell? I got third. How did I get third? I feel like I got everything wrong. Okay, I got this. I got this one right. Didn't get the margin right. Got this one right. Almost got the margin right for this one. Storm didn't get this one right. Roosters by four. Got this one. Didn't get this one. I had sharks by ten. Yikes. Seventy-seven percent had sharks. Holy crap. Okay. Eels by six. I got this wrong. Got this wrong. Warriors by two. I got this right. Okay, interesting. So I didn't actually get them. I only got like five of them right, but I ended up in third. That's interesting. Best pool performance each round. Oh, this is total. This is total. Okay, how do I do just by round? Here we go. Here's okay. Here's the, here's the just by round. Okay. Okay, that that makes sense. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I, I was in. I, I was. In, I only had five points. I was in the middle of the the pack. It looks like in round uh, in round two. They're round twelve here. Uh, Saint Jai wins it. Uh, NRE edits. There you go. Runner up. Demo. Yeah. It looks like. Yeah, this week was harder to predict, right? Like 8.5 was the highest. What was round 11? Yeah, there's a lot more people did better last week. Yeah, interesting. Okay. Yeah, leaderboard. Let's check out the leaderboard. Obviously, this leaderboard is a bit um, because some people weren't in here in the first week. It's a bit different. It's not not like a, a true leaderboard. But um, yeah, so Smudge leading the way. Demos in two. I'm in third, which I'm, I'm pretty proud of that so far, but obviously early. Uh, Bell W's in fourth, St. J's in fifth, edits in sixth. Um, did anyone do where is like Dobby? Dobby looks like he had a better week. Um, Backy does not look like he had another, he didn't have a good week, it looks like. <laughs> and then these guys, Kyle got the golden or got the wooden spoon this week in his, his first week in the league. Um, sorry, I guess. <laughs> do better next week. Let's let's go. Um, yeah, so that that's the league for for NRL for the Super Brew, and then we'll check out the comps for this one. Let's do round twelve. Round twelve, we had Husen Crisis with number one, Chasman number two, Enery number three, Wacko's Warriors number four, Super Sharks number five, Cleary Clears Clears. That's an awesome name. Edis would be proud of that name. Um, and yeah, so yeah, not a huge gap between people this week it seems um yeah where did i finish where where am i 16 okay i was like middle of the pack yeah middle of the pack that's fine i guess how did why is backy right here he only had one point and zero what does that mean 
How is he 24th when he had one point? Interesting, okay. Um, let's look at all rounds. Total. Total points, total margin. RT number one, Kyle number two, Corey number three, Archerodon, Archeriodon number four, and Samuel number five. Um, I'm at number nine here through two weeks. That's, yeah, that's decent, I guess. Um, yeah. Alrighty, so we have, we got Ibru up, we have the team list up, and we have the ladder up. Um, yeah, so game one is Eels Sharks. I do know, um, yeah, where, where does it show the ins and outs? Yeah, ins, holy, so many guys. Outs, yeah, so yeah, Sharks lost Hines and McKins to, uh, to Origin, and the Eels lost Hopkins, Hopkid. Um, it looks like their player is back too. A couple of their players are back. Yeah. There's not too many. This, yeah, this isn't like, a, there's not too many guys from the Sharks missing. So I'm, I think I'm just going to go with Sharks. Uh, did the Eels, what happened? The, did the Eels win last game? No, they're on a big losing streak. Yeah, yeah, they fired their coach. Okay. Um, how, how much of a gap should I put here? I'm going to do Sharks by... Sharks by 12. Yeah. We'll try Sharks by 12. No Hines might be iffy, but we'll see. We'll just lock that in. Um, okay, we got Knights Bulldogs. Bulldogs, I did see, had a lot of guys in Origin, I believe. Um, yeah, th yeah th there's three. Only three. Why is there so many? Why is there seven ins but only three outs? I just noticed that. And the same as this. Why is there so many ins but only one out? Weird. Huh, okay. Uh, yeah, Knights are off of the bye. I don't think they have any. I don't, yeah, I don't think I saw any. Yeah, they, Knights don't have any Origin players. Okay, Bulldogs have Sexton, Hutchinson, Burns away in Blues camp. Crichton, 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 Crichton. Yeah, Crichton also on state duty. Um, okay. Yeah, so we got Bulldogs. Are the Knights? How are the Knights? The Knights are doing decent. Hmm. Knights, Bulldogs. Bulldogs have the 47. Hmm. They're 0 and 0. Okay, the Bulldogs are 0 and 6 away. What are this is this is a home game for the Knights. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna go Knights, I think. 0 and 6 on the road is kind of insane. That feels like it's hard to ignore, even though it might just be a fluke. Um yeah, so we'll we'll go Knights. It'll be close though. We go with uh let's go Knights by four. Yeah, let's lock that in. All right, Panthers, Dragons. This one's going to be interesting. Okay, so the, I think the Dragons actually do have some guys at, at um, uh, yeah. Look, look, look how many, look how many, look how many guys are out. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Lomax, Sua, Sua, and Hunt. I saw for the Dragons. Okay, so the Panthers also have lots of guys out, but I feel like they're better equipped to deal with the players missing. Um. Yeah, five stars away. Hmm. Do I think? Dragons, I don't know, the Dragons, okay, yeah, the Dragons are one of the worst teams, what am I thinking? Not one of the worst, but they're, like, near the bottom. Yeah, the Panthers should be able to, to, to beat them still. Um, definitely interesting, though. It's, it's, I didn't realize how many, like, players, like, I mean, obviously, there's, you need two teams of players, but yeah, it's crazy that they have, in the middle of the season, they have, like, players just, like, missing weeks. It's kind of, kind of crazy. Um, yeah. I think, hmm, I don't think it'll be a blowout. It'll be like, Panthers, I mean, eight's a pretty big margin, I guess, but we'll go Panthers by eight. And Panthers are at home too, okay. Uh, Dolphins, Raiders, okay, these teams are pretty close in the standings, right? Yeah. Dolphins, or no, they're, yeah, their stats are a lot different though. Dolphins, Raiders. Uh, how many guys are out for each on this team? I forget. Young. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Dolphins have two out. Raiders just one. Um. Two. Okay. Raiders got a guy back from suspension. Okay. Yeah. This one's doesn't seem. This one doesn't seem too impacted by in, by uh, origin, but who knows? Um. I think the safe bet is just dolphins here. Their point differential is pretty crazy, and yeah, yeah. We'll go. We'll go dolphins by four 
four. Four is fine. And then last one, Roosters, Cowboys. Cowboys had a shocking amount of players at Origin. I was really surprised how many guys are at Origin, considering how poorly they've been doing the last uh, the last like little while. Um, they're obviously extremely good offensively, though, so maybe that's kind of why. Um, but yeah, they had like actually both these teams. I don't, yeah, both these teams. Both these teams have a ton. Okay, yeah. But yeah, Cowboys like Roosters are obviously a way better team, right? So. Um, yeah, this obviously just come down who has better better depth on the bench and all that. So I'm not really sure. Um, Luke Carey has been named at 5'8 and expected to be released from MSW camp where he's on standby for Hines. Okay, so he's like the backup for Hines right now. Interesting. Yeah, mass changes for you. Yeah. Hmm. This is, this is probably the hardest one to choose. How are the Cowboys on the road? Three and four, three and two, roosters three and two, three and two. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this one's tough. I think I'm gonna go roosters, just home team. And the Cowboys have one two in a row though, but it's against the Tigers and the Rab. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah, they've only won two games of their last. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Two of their last seven, and they're against really bad teams. Okay, we'll go roosters. Uh, Cowboys score a lot, so we'll, we'll say it's a close game just because the Cowboys can produce offense. So we'll go, yeah, Roosters by four. So there's the picks. I'll lock that in. Um, let me go to the NRL tipping site and get that locked in as well. Yeah, we had Sharks tips saved. Okay. And now. All right. Yeah, so that is the round 13 tips um, and the round 12 uh recap i guess um yeah make sure to join if you're not already in there um i guess i, sh I should have made this video a bit earlier apologies i usually get it out a bit earlier um but yeah, hopefully you guys can hop in there before it's too late to join this round um yeah hoping to get more people uh, make sure to join the discord as well it's pretty active for the nrl stuff in there um lots of like friendly banter and stuff we got a, a couple couple guys there a little uh, a little rowdy but it's it's been good um yeah, and I guess I, I'm I might not be doing a stream this week because of uh Yeah, we'll see. It it'll, it'll be Roosters Cowboys if I do, but I might I might not. We'll see. We'll see this we'll see. Um yeah, let's wrap it up there. Thanks for watching.